Nikki Nipia was raised by his grandparents in Ruatahuna in the Uruweras. Nipia is a jade carver, a specialist in the ancient form of bowl form carving. Originating from China, the style of carving he uses is really seen in New Zealand, but he will display it at the Chinese fashion show this weekend. Nipia has also designed 20 pendants infused with both Māori and Chinese designs. The theme of, of use is a, a combination between Māori and Chinese, so a lot of my pieces um, have um, beads. It's all New Zealand greenstone, so I'll be using beads for the necklaces with a uh, New Zealand pendant um, could be like a tiki, a koru, a toki. Nipia learnt the 6,000 year old carving technique in China under the guidance of several master carvers at the House of Jade Museum. So I guess one of the special ones I got to, I got to actually live with um, while I was there the longest was uh, Mr Pan and he's an old master from Beijing and he come down to the World of Jade Museum, which is down in Suhui, and he read all the old scriptures of um, jade carving. So Mr. Pan, his father was the first titled master carver in China. Another carver, master carver I studied with was Mr. Wei. Um, he specialised in medium, medium vase pieces, like teapots, um, small vases, and then we had Mr Wong, um, who specialises in the larger forms of bowl forms, um, ranging up to a metre high by a metre wide. Nipia says he's privileged to have learnt the ancient practice and teaches willing students the sacred art. These techniques have been handed down for thousands of years um, and that's kind of why I feel privileged to, to have studied in China. It's not like something we just whip up, they whip up, um, you know, everything had to be correct. Um, the right tools had to be correct. The form had to be correct. Uh, when it comes to teapots, um, certain masters would carve them so they sit in different pressure points in your palm. Nipia will also be displaying a wakahuya carved from jade along with five other unique sculptures. Delilah Faitiri, Local Focus.